Hi guys, welcome to my channel. After a very long time, I'm back on YouTube and today I'll be doing something very simple, a simple makeup look I'm just going to do. So I have, as you can see that I have already prepped my skin. I have moisturized it well and I'll not be using any kind of primer or anything. I'll straight go ahead with the concealer. So yeah, without any further ado, let's begin. So I'm taking this Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade 30 honey and this is my perfect match so what I'm gonna do is I'll be just using it here like this so as you can see I have taken a weight sponge and I'm just gonna set the concealer wherever I need to I'm not rubbing it against my skin, I'm just tapping the concealer on my skin. Now the concealer is set. Now what I'm gonna do is I'll be taking uh, the foundation and for that I'll use this Maybelline Pore uh, Matte Poreless Foundation. This is a Fit Me Matte Poreless uh, in the shade Honey I think. This is 235 Pure Beige so this is my shade. Um, when my skin is not tanned this is exactly my shade but when my skin is a little bit tanned it is a bit lighter than my complexion so yeah. I'll be taking this just before applying I'll be shaking this foundation and then I'm gonna take this much and using the same sponge I'm just using it So I have done my foundation now what I'm gonna do is I'm set the I'm gonna set the makeup using this setting powder this is from sugar and this is their all set to go translucent powder I really love this powder this is affordable as well as very effective efficiently does the job so I'm just taking this brush and so you need to be really careful as to how much you are using so I'm just gonna take this much first it is always wise to take little bit of makeup and then gradually as per your need you can always add but it is very difficult to tone it down so I'll suggest whatever makeup you do make sure that you are taking the smallest amount possible and then you can gradually build it up but build it down is really uh, very messy and uh, cumbersome I feel I'll be using this illegal brow kit medium. It is quite a compact product to be very precise. 
it has this wax and these two pigments uh, you can use uh, whatever your uh, eyebrow color is depending on your eyebrow color you can use uh, one of these two and also there is a highlighter shade so it is quite compact and it comes with this mini tools as you can see a mini tweezer and also this eyebrow brush which i really find uh, handy so yeah and it has also a mirror so this is really a good product to use i'm gonna use this wax so i'll be taking a little bit of this product and then apply it to set my eyebrows like so Well, the eyebrow is set what I'll do is I'll be filling up a little bit of filling is needed so I'll be taking this dark brown shade and using this small uh, brush make sure that you are just dabbing when you whenever you are using this brush make sure that you are just going vertical with this not this this just go vertical with this and take the product and then i'll be using it wherever i need some filling So the brow is done now I'll be taking this shadow stick this is from K Beauty and I really find it handy guys if you have no, no time if you are pressed for time or you don't like like you don't know how to apply your eyeshadow but you want to use some eyeshadow then this is a go-to product for you pick any I'm not the reason I'm mentioning this brand is I'm using it so pick any choice of your uh, pick any kind of eyeshadow stick that would do like a, your choice of eyeshadow stick uh, so yeah I'll be using this brown shade and I'm just gonna make this like this this is so beginner friendly guys you don't need to know any kind of application technique as to how you can apply your foundation your eyeshadow so you, all you need to do is just put some color here and then just blend 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 and this is a creamy product so you would have no issue blending it but make sure you are always gentle with your skin so not to cause any kind of crease or any kind of wrinkle so I'm just going like this and as you can see that the color is nice and I really love how it creates a subtle shade this is my go-to like on an everyday basis i use this uh, eyeshadow stick i really love it and this is sharpenable so yeah Now it's time for me to add some mascara and for that I'll be using this Maybelline Hyper Curl Eye Wash. So this is a wash proof, this is a, a washable one. This also has this wash proof option but I always try to go with the washable option because it is a lot easier for me to remove it. I don't use any kind of false lashes or anything, just a little bit, just a little bit of mascara is enough for me so I'm just going to lightly coat my eye eyelashes like this
so for my lips i'll be using this nika lips don't lie in the shade uh, date night this is a nice wine red color so i don't have a red red lip liner so i'll be using it um, for the lack of a red lip liner but it would do like i'll be using a red lip color so i'm choosing this kind of color so for my lips i'll be choosing this color this is a deep night and this is a nice uh, deep wine color as you can see and this can be used separately as a lipstick as well as a lip color as well because it is so creamy and this is a lip filler plus lip liner so it does the dual job uh, you can always go without a lipstick just carrying this one it could serve you as a lip liner as well as a lip color This red lipstick this is from Estee Lauder and this is a pure color love lipstick in the shade bar red I really love this red a lot this is like a classic red color and a very good shade flattering one So guys this is my final look and I hope you like this video if you do please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also please let me know in the comment section what are the other beauty videos you want me to make on this channel I would love to take your suggestions and whatever is possible for me I'll be bring it, bringing it on on this channel and I hope you find this video helpful and my idea was to show you guys that using very minimal product you can actually pull off a good makeup look uh, without involving so many products and so many other things like makeup tools and techniques you can just do it very efficiently very quickly without involving too much product too much time and effort so yeah my idea was to do just that to show you guys how simply a makeup can be done uh, with that i'll take you leave for now and i'll see you guys with my next video bye